Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying five Boots beverages. Uh, we have tried some Boots beverages before on the channel, so if you're interested, just type in Tammy Dunn Boots, it'll come up. Uh, we have the Caramel Apple Soda, the Strawberries and Cream, the Dewberry, Sarsaparilla, Sarsaparilla, and Coconut. These coconut. are- Coconut Cream. Coconut Cream, ooh. These were $1.99 each at Jungle Gems International Market. Um, it says, Laura Kristen. Laura was Boots' mother. Her charm and scratch caramel apple strudel settled husband Ambrose down. I know, odd, I'm reading. That's an odd paragraph. I know. Let me, let me, let's start this again. Laura was Boots' mother. Apple strudel. No, I just skipped a line. We're going to do this again. <laughs> Laura Kristen. Laura was Boots' mother. Her charm and scratch caramel apple strudel settled husband Ambrose down in Round Top, Texas in 1893. That is the worst sentence I've ever read. I know. Settled I don't, down? What I don't care mean? how many times you read that, because I like to read. I can read, believe it or not. And that is a horribly written sentence. <laughs> yeah. Um, they bought Belleville Bottling Works in 1930. We've got her caramel apple strudel in this very bottle. They're trying to make it like a... Um, country. A little country, I think. Because they spelled it. apple strudel incorrectly. They spelled it A-P-F-E-L-S. Apple. Apple strudel. So that's probably how they pronounce it. Uh, these come out of Belleville, Texas. Um, and they're trying to add a country bent on it, it, but it's hard to read that, you know? <laughs> it's um, <hard> to read. <laughs> uh, made with pure cane sugar, it is 170 calories for one bottle. It's <laughs> kind of like reading the book, um, like Uncle Tom's Cabin. If you've never read that, it's a hard read. It's I thought not, it was It's hard. written like they speak. Yes, and it's so it, it's it's when when uh, they when authors write in that dialect once you get into the groove of it, you it you're see. fine. Because you can imagine, at least when I read, I take longer to read because I'm doing the voices in my head. So once you're doing <laughs> She acts the whole thing. I act the whole, yeah, it's, it's, like, it's like a play. I act it out in my mind. Uh, but once you get the hang of it, it's fine. But at first, it's a hard book. Mm -hmm. It really is. So this is like that. I was not prepared for that, as you could tell. So back to the drink. It's caramel apple soda. Uh, Stephen King does the same thing with the main, the writing, and you're like, how would you say that word? Yeah. You have to think about it for a minute. Very apple-y. Mm -hmm. I love that. I think it's delicious. I do too. It's got a little bite to it. Mm -hmm. Not a like bitter bite, just a, like a tart bite. I don't know. To it's me, good though. It's very sweet. I get mainly caramel. <clears throat> I'm it, left with caramel. Yes, and it's so delicious. It's yep. very, very syrupy sweet. Mm -hmm. It would remind you, like if you bought a caramel apple and you were to take your finger and run that caramel off of it, that is what that tastes like. It's so delicious. Yeah, but it does have that little bite of apple in there too. So, yes, yeah, I would good. buy that again oh and again. Delicious. I'm not reading anymore. Because <laughs> this, this, is, um, this is a different part, person. Yeah, that was Laura. This one's about soup. Forget it. I'm not reading it. 170 calories for strawberries and cream. <laughs> you know, Boots, we bought Boots. We've never seen these flavors. We bought Boots at yeah. Tuesday morning. Oh, is that where we bought mm -hmm. them? Pretty sure we've seen them at Tuesday morning. They didn't, they didn't have many of them, just a few. But It smells like strawberry when you first get up your mouth. It's a little artificial. I do not care for that at all. We've got, it's amazing the spectrum here because one, I would get like that caramel apple, I would buy that all the time. Mm -hmm. The strawberries and cream, it does not taste like even strawberries to me. It's so artificial. Yeah, that, it's almost chemical like. Yeah, it's so artificial that I, if I was blindfolded, I would say, oh, it has maybe a little underlying strawberry, but it's mainly just chemical. Yeah, yeah, you do get strawberry, but it's a, it's very artificial. Yeah, it just doesn't taste natural at all. And and we've had enough strawberry sodas to where you can make it taste natural. Oh, yeah. Even yeah. though it's not, it can taste that way. And they it, that just yeah. doesn't. This is the Dewberry, and it's 170 calories. And that's about somebody else, some little kid. 
Yeah, I'm, I'm popped. You could tell I don't practice for the video because I, I was not prepared. Yeah. yeah, it smells okay. good. Gotta have a, have a great smell. Yeah. Oh, I like that. It. Definitely not great. No, but it does. It tastes. Like blueberry. That's what I was gonna say. It tastes like a cross between a blueberry and a blackberry. <clears throat> I can see that. Yeah. I like it. Yeah, it's good. Really it's not good. as strong as the apple, but and it's not as artificial as a strawberry. It's mm -hmm. a nice flavor. That if if the the caramel apple is like pure on one hundred percent dessert soda. This tastes like you're drinking something that might be halfway good for you. It's not. Um, it's not, but it, it, you know, it tastes healthier. Uh, but, but I really do like it, and I can buy that all the time, too. Yeah. Uh, this is the sarsaparilla. Sarsaparilla. <laughs> you have to say it properly. It's 170 calories. Sarsaparilla. got to say it like you're walking in the saloon. Give me a sarsaparilla. Not bad. It's a little watered down tasting, but I like the bite of the of the sarsaparilla flavor. Yeah, it's not one that I would have all the time. I like it, but I do. I do like it. Yeah, that's I like do. my number two so far. Really? Oh yeah. I no, like I really. I, I think it's nice, but uh, just not one that I would get all the time. I like it quite a bit. It's, it reminds you of root beer somewhat. But uh, it's it's a little sweeter with less bite, with less like spices. That's a very good description. Yeah, yeah. I, I, but I think sarsaparilla. Yeah. That's really like the original root beer. Coconut cream. Uh, this is natural flavors, caffeine free, free gluten free. One hundred seventy. I think they've all been one hundred seventy mm -hmm. calories. Getting to that stage where I've drank enough carbonated. That it's, I know. Was the first one one hundred seventy? Because it's like yeah, it was. So it's like if you could have that caramel apple. For the same calories as these, I would just do that. It's a very, very, very strong. It's on the border of being artificial flavor too, though. Yes. Yeah, it's like a, chemically artificial. Not quite as chemical as the strawberry is, but it is very artificial. But I can taste where they've made it creamy. So it almost does taste like, yeah, especially after when you're talking, it does have a creaminess to it like you've eaten a piece of candy. It's very sweet. Like a box of chocolates, like the coconut cream. Yes, box of chocolate you get candy. that after and yeah, it is I agree. creamy. Yeah, the aftertaste is, is okay. It's The aftertaste I think is better than why you're actually drinking yeah. it because it's kind of harsh while you're drinking yeah, it. Yeah, the strawberry never got better. No. That that actually settles pretty nicely. Yeah. Um, still, the only two I'd buy is the sarsaparilla and the apple, though. Yeah, I, I had that before I did the coconut. Um, <laughs> the coconut's not bad, but the sarsaparilla is real. I, I really, really like the sarsaparilla. Oh, wow. I really like the apple and the dewberries. Sarsaparilla good. would be my third choice. Yeah. Um, so we have the same three. Absolutely. Just different orders. Those, these three: the caramel apple, the dewberry, and the sarsaparilla. Yeah. Those are the ones. Those are the best. Ones. Um, Basically, coconut, you could drink the coconut, but I don't know why you'd want to. The ones that say cream are the ones that we did not choose. So maybe it's the cream that's the. I don't know. That's the artificial. I don't know. Yeah. You wouldn't know unless you tried a straight up strawberry, strawberry, unless you had like a strawberry and then the strawberries and cream, and the same with the coconut. So I, I can't say whether it's the yeah. cream or not. I don't know. Um, yeah, but. Any of these, uh, and you would think oh, in a lot of companies the caramel apple would be a seasonal. I sure would hope that that wouldn't be a seasonal because it's so it's good, good, it should be out all the time. Yeah. Yeah, if this is one of those drinks you, you have every couple days or once a week or something. Oh, or absolutely. Treat, that's what we would do. Yeah, is have it as a treat. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.